Okay, so um, we're going to look at analysis two, which is going to be based more around tourism and branding um, instead of business and branding. Um, tourism is really a form of business, um, but we're looking more at the tourism um, tech, uh, terminology. So we have five uh, materials that we're going to look at for these preparatory um, sections. And then what we're going to do is work our way through uh, seven questions. So the first preparatory material um, is an article from the South Australian Tourism Commission's brand strategy. And so what this is kind of helping us to understand is what are um, Tourism SA doing to help to promote South Australia and regions like Kangaroo Island. So as you can see here, um, we're getting uh, some sort of examples of, oh, uh, of the types of design choices that they're making to meet um, their tourism aims. And we can see that they're driven by a desire to create awareness and to sell SA, basically. So one of the big um, campaigns that they did a few years ago was the uh, Let Yourself Go campaign for Kangaroo Island, which is obviously going to be our focus. Um, and we can see that this was successful because we have... Uh, an increase in awareness, an increase in consideration of the uh, space, like you know, what, what do people think about when they go to Kangaroo Island, and uh, behavioural measures. So, just clicking button and seeing what's happening. Um, so we have also got uh, some really clear quantifiable evidence of the sorts of things that we have seen improve because of this type of um, advertising. And what's really important is that most of this has come from the eastern states. So we've had people who may not know about the area becoming familiar with the uh, KI brand. Okay. So that's preparatory material one. Short, sharp and shiny. Preparatory material two is the Let Yourself Go advertisement, and this is the one that SATC, South Australian Tourism Commission, um, uh, yeah, created. So this, this is the ad that was so successful. So I've just taken a few screenshots of some sections that I thought were particularly useful for us because when um, oh that's triple J, uh, when we look at the ad, there's this particular aesthetic that is being um, created. So it's very uh, dreamy and moody and uh, very artistic. It's not your typical like come down and have a nice summer holiday kind of vibe. So make sure you watch the whole video. Um, and what we're really getting is a sense of the natural beauty and the natural um, space that makes Kangaroo Island such an interesting destination. So that's really important for your brand because that's what you're selling as well. The third section um, is a set of materials about tourism. So tourism has a whole bunch of different models. And what these models do basically is they try and explain the way people buy holidays and how they actually engage with um, areas to become um, tourists. Okay. So what we've got is um, a series of different models and we're going to talk through some of the relevant ones. Now, I have um, put in some links to give you a little bit more detail and we will talk about these in more detail later. But um, then um, we will yeah, go through and kind of give you a bit more of an overview. So there's all these different models that we'll look at. The fourth model, uh, sorry, the fourth material is the article about um, the lady who it was in the newspaper, um, who has been creating the Kangaroo Island Remarkable brand. And so it's an authentic product. And it's really, it's an example of how a business has taken